Coach, the season didn't end the way you wanted, not getting to finish the bowl game. How hungry is this team, and what does this coaching staff focus on as they get them prepared for this season? Well, I think our team's real hungry. As you said, the uh, bowl game and the way we finished the season, I don't think any of us were happy about that. Um, and uh, our focus right now is, is squarely on our opener against Virginia Tech. You know, it's a tough conference opener. It's one of the tougher openers in the country. Well, we want, you know, we start with Virginia Tech. It's a big game for us. Um, we want to come out and make a statement and, and say who we are. Oh, uh, we're very hungry. Uh, we feel like we left a lot of the, a lot of meat on the bone last year, and uh, we're ready to uh, kind of come full throttle. How would you describe your game? What makes you such a dynamic player? Um, I mean, I guess I would say I have size, and uh, for my size, I have pretty good speed, and um, I've been blessed with uh, the ability to have good vision. Um, but. I've really been working on some of my weaknesses um, this offseason, um, and I feel like that's what's really going to set me apart, um, being able to kind of excel uh, with those perceived weaknesses. I think AJ's real healthy. He was real healthy for that bowl game. He's been healthy through spring. Um, I think he's, it's hard to, hard to believe, but he's, he's getting stronger. He's trimming his body fat, which I don't think there's any there to trim, um, and he's getting more explosive and, 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 and faster. So I think he's focused and, and, and very motivated for a great season. Oh, it takes it feels like a lot of pressure off of us, you know. We love to watch him on the on the scoreboard, you know, it gives us energy. I watch him score is, is a great feeling. When you have those big backs that have that punishing capability, um, you can keep your offense on the field, you can keep your defense off the field, and you can wear down opposing defenses. And I think, I think uh, I'm a big believer in the power run game that we have, that those big backs are, are really important. And as AJ said, you know, we have a young guy named David Bailey who's right in line. He's another 250 pound big back. So uh, when you can stretch the field uh, vertically and horizontally, you have, you have to contend with a, a really good offensive line and a really good power running back, right? A quarterback that can run and can throw. And then we have edge people that we have legitimate speed. I think that gives you an opportunity to be explosive. Now the key is, is stay healthy. Defensively, you guys have hung your hat on that during your tenure there. What do you do to get this group back to where they've been in the past? We have to establish a, a great identity uh, on, on defense. Um, and I think we've had that in, in, in our past. And I think we're going to go through that metamorphosis, if you will, where we've lost some players. And now this group has got to develop a, a, an identity. You know, how much pressure will we be? You know, how, how, how much zone coverage will we play? But I, I'm excited about it because we have talent. And uh, some of it's young, but it's talent. What do the Boston College Eagles need to do to really make some noise in their land? We, we have the most competitive league in the country. I've been in them all, and this is the ACC is the most competitive. We have to stay healthy, and then you've got to be physically and mentally tough enough to take the daily and weekly grind from game to game and finish at the end. So come out of the blocks really strong, have a little good fortune with our health, and then really our, work at our mental toughness because I don't care who you are along the way, you're going to get some unbelievably unique challenges, and you got to overcome them.